in the blue box, we can see is basically the browser. So we represent the browser and the user behavior. Now, the thing is that let's say the user wants to log in. What it happens, obviously, the browser actually makes a request to my backend server. Hey, this user wants to log in. Now, the backend server is configured to use an identity provider. In our case, it was Microsoft Entra ID, but it could be anything else. Now, the thing is that my server, my backend, let's say API or the backend for frontend, redirects the user to the authentication or identity provider for login. The user gets there, it logs in, and then what it happens is obviously that the identity provider redirects the user back to my API, not to the browser, but back to my API or my backend for frontend. And here it means that my server is actually the central control plane of everything that relates the identity or the authentication of that specific user. What do I do now? Obviously on the server side, so in the browser nothing happens yet. The browser still waits. So on the server side, I obviously go through the entire PKCE flow in which I exchange what I need to exchange and get back a final ID token and an access token. And the thing is that I can then save the, these tokens on the server side, create a cookie and actually send back to the browser the cookie. 